Milton, sit! Good boy, Plopper. Good boy, Ploppy. Now you're starting to act like Madeline. Look at your mother. Look at the camera. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Yeah, yeah. Morning, guys. I am about to go live on YouTube on my channel, Watch Autumn, for the October Fast Challenge. Don't forget, I'm going live every single morning at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time this entire month for the October Fast Challenge on YouTube. Um, I will put a link to my Watch Autumn channel right here so that you can subscribe and ding that notification bell if you want uh, to be notified whenever I go live. But set an alarm because it's 9.30 a.m. every single day. Good morning, everyone. I feel like I'm doing the gangster lean, but that's okay. Good morning, everyone. I have been awake for a while. I'm probably going, yes, no, I'm definitely going to exercise right after this because as we've discussed, if I don't exercise in the morning, I won't do it. Like if I get into another project and like don't exercise, then I won't exercise. Today is Sunday, October the 6th. Uh, day six, part of my October fast challenge. Yesterday, I weighed in. I was 186.2. Today, I weighed in. I was... Uh, uh, and the exact same. So, like, you guys, I am totally okay with that. I... I am about to have my zip fizz and you notice I'm doing the double duty because I'm talking to both of you guys right now. You guys are in the future. You guys are in the present. How are you doing? Okay, so I am having zip fizz. What flavor am I having? Bam! Peach mango. There we have it. There we have it, everyone. Peach mango. I am excited about my hashtag wax swag. Okay. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, it smells so peach mango-y and delicious. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's get ready to shake it in three, two, one. I'm doing double duty today. It's like when you have to decide, like, which one of your kids you love the most. It's like, I love them equally, so <laughs> I have to go back and forth. <laughs> to week two of the challenge and to feeling great. Mmm. Oh, oh, it's so good. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, I must have just like woke up from like a charcuterie coma or something like that. First of all, I made the most amazing charcuterie board ever. Second of all, like, I fell asleep. <laughs> like, I just straight up fell asleep. And if you know anything about me, you know that I can't sleep during the day. I can't take no naps. So like, the fact that I just popped my head up and I was like, oh my God, where am I? What time is it? What have I done? And the answer is nothing. I have not done anything. So I have not prepped near near a meal and like I have to go to the shop. It's 3.30 and like I have to get there so that I can get back home. Then I'll come home and meal prep. I'm having marinara and pepperoni beef. Like, can you call that pizza? Like if you just heat up some meat and then put some marinara sauce on it. Is that like pizza casserole? Like I'm really not doing anything else and I'm really not mixing the mozzarella into it. I'm gonna put that on it each day I heat it up. So I'm just browning up some ground beef and throwing some pepperonis in there and then stirring in some marinara. I am making my chocolate cocoa uh, fat bombs. I'll put the recipe right there. It is delicious. Uh, and then I'm having a bunch of other stuff, but like I feel so behind, but guys, I guess I needed that. Like that nap was life. And the, so much stuff went on. I was watching the Ravens Steelers game and the freaking quarterback is out. I was like, I barely understood when Ben Roethlisberger went away. Now who's this new guy? And they're like, oh yeah, Mason Rudolph got like knocked unconscious. And I was like, what did I miss? Like, geez Louise. So all that matters is I'm back up and I'm on my way to work. And then when I get home, I will meal prep and we will finish out this day and I will have some ice cream. That's probably like the most important part and why I'm racing back home. But like, I'll catch up with you guys later. But like, I literally woke up from the twilight zone. Like I have no idea what's happening right now.
guys, I am done with meal prep, so I'm gonna let everything cool and I'm gonna go sit down and get ready for football to come on. And while I do that, I am going to enjoy some Rebel Creamery. This is the cookie dough flavor. Now I've had this sitting out for about 90 minutes. Like you guys, I let the, the ice cream sit out and get like all the way soft. It says like, it says for the creamiest ice cream, let your pint soften for at least 15 minutes. Like, I mean, I take it way past that, almost to the point where it kind of gets like soft serve. I mean, you guys, look how creamy this is. This is the first time I've ever had cookie dough. So you are getting the live taste test. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's soft serve. Mmm. Oh, wow. So I'm just tasting the ice cream and the ice cream is delicious. Okay, now this one has chocolate chips and the cookie dough bits. This is delicious. Like this is just delicious. I think the longer you let it sit out, the more like actual ice cream it tastes. Like this is so good. And I mean, the crazy thing is the middle is still quite frozen. Like this has literally been sitting out for 90 minutes. I don't ever think there's an instance in which you can let these sit out too long, you know? So set it out, do you some chores for an hour or something and come back and it'll be there waiting for you. I'm gonna enjoy this, watch some football and then I'll come back and wrap up meal prep. Okay guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like I literally forgot that I did not finish the video and like I done changed into my jammies and everything. Like this is my night robe. Like, it's almost 10.30, I need to be asleep. I was literally in bed and I was like, I did not finish my meal prep. So uh, I can't go through the whole spread right now. I am deliriously sleepy, but I will say that I made this casserole. It's literally just ground beef, pepperonis, and some of that Rails uh, tomato sauce. And then I did make my fat bombs. For meal prep, I plan to have the pizza casserole mixed in with that mozzarella that I chopped up, as well as topped with Parmesan cheese when it goes into the microwave. I plan to have two of these fat bombs at each meal, and then also for snacks, I'm going to have an ounce of almonds, some pork rinds, oh yeah, and some dip. I bought this dip, it's just two grams of carbs per two tablespoons. This one is sriracha three cheese. I also have like a spinach artichoke. I was just in the mood for pork rind and dip this week. So I'm going to have that as well as I do have room for a bulletproof coffee. So I'm bringing back the coffee with some of that keto collagen. Let me go get it. I have the preferred keto chocolate collagen. This is my favorite collagen. I'm having this with some coffee and some chocolate almond milk and a couple tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. I do have a code for this. It is WAC10 for 10% off. It's in the description box below as well as the link to the website. This is my favorite. Maddie's also my favorite. Maddie thinks we're going outside. Not at 10 o'clock at night or not. Madeline. Madeline, what are you eating off the floor? Why are you so bad, Maddie? Why? Madeline. Madeline, look up. Madeline, look at your mother. Madeline. Gosh. Okay guys, if you want to see how I put this all together, be sure to watch my What I Eat Wednesday video. Uh, it'll actually be what I'm eating on Tuesday because Monday, Wednesday, and Friday of this week, I am fasting, so I'm not gonna be eating anything. You can hear all about that every day at 9.30 a.m on my other channel, Watch Autumn. I go live and talk about the October Fast Challenge. I'm excited to have this stuff, but I'm even more excited to go to sleep, so that's what I'm gonna do right now. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and I'll talk to you next week.